All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. And today, we are gonna be breaking out the JP account to do some summons for the new Int Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Now, as you guys know, I don't do a ton of videos, at least summoning videos for the JP side, but this guy is just way too hype to uh, pass up right now. And I asked people on stream yesterday and a lot of people seem to wanna see this. So here it is. We're gonna do six multis, 300 stones, and uh, whatever happens, happens now a quick look at the banner here it's um interesting i would say it's interesting i wouldn't say it's amazing i wouldn't say it's bad just uh interesting i think is the right word so we got in super saiyan 4 gogeta the new nova shenron who is also pretty good and uh lr go bros now this is the reason why i say it's interesting because it seems like they've been featured a ton is it just me i don't know like it feels like they've been featured a lot of times since their initial banner on jp and it feels like their plan, like Bandai's plan, is just to throw this guy on like any banner that might otherwise seem kind of meh or seem kind of trash. They're like, yo, yo, hold on, we got LR GoBros on there, so it's a good banner, right? But if you look at the rest of the banner, it's uh, really not like super exciting in my opinion. So we got Kefla, who is obviously very good. Piccolo's good too. And then we have full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku, which I guess makes sense given the theme-ish of the banner, but still. Um, you know, he's not like the greatest anymore, especially defensively. And uh, we got, of course, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, which makes sense. Omega Shenron, which I guess makes sense. So like these picks make sense to me. It's just like the actual units now, given how old they are, given uh, how some of them are quite outdated. I mean, still usable, but you know, outdated by today's standards. Um, I don't think it's like the best banner I've seen, honestly, but there's LR Go Bros. So I guess that makes it a good banner. And uh, why don't we do a little ritual here nothing too crazy let's just play the animation and then maybe we'll break the code or, or no it's a uh, crack the code and then we'll get into it okay so here we go and apparently to crack the code all we got to do is go to character details and do this three times one two three oh crap i did four one two three and we're jumping in we did the thing so nobody can say, oh, you should have done this or done that to, to get some luck, because I don't believe in that stuff. I mean, sometimes I do. Sometimes I do. When I get really desperate, which I'm not right now. We got Krillin. Okay. So uh, maybe JP's going to welcome me back to their side with, a, with an immediate uh, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta pull right here, right now. Oh, okay. Nova Shenron. All right. All right. We got, we got one of the new units. I'm not too mad about that. I would prefer Gogeta, obviously, but yo, we got Nova Shenron first. He's excellent, so no complaints from me. Okay, no, no complaints from me. But hopefully, at some point in this video, we get Gogeta, so I can actually, I mean, really do something on the JP side. Like I, I keep this JP account. Like I've had it for a long time now, but it's just like I don't really have a have motivation to play it too much. So if I pull Gogeta here. Then you can probably expect quite a few uh, more JP videos, a little bit more JP content on the channel because that would give me a reason to actually grind the account, right? And actually put some time into it. Because I think there's actually still quite a few... Ooh, yo, scared me for a second. Okay, we got we got beers coming in. We got beers coming in. Uh, maybe a Whis animation. Very unlikely, but definitely possible. Super Saiyan 1. Hold on. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say, like, I feel like if you get a really bad animation, there's a higher chance to get a Whis. But now that we chat, we have Super Saiyan 1 and nothing else, um, we're, we're pretty much screwed. This this multi's dead. Um, yeah, so what was I saying again? I forgot. I was I was I was saying something. And it just like completely disappeared. Uh, how about you guys let me know in the comments down below for all of my JP players out there? Did you guys summon? For Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, and if you did, how many stones did you spend? Okay, and also, did you pull him? That's also an important question. Did you get shafted? Did you get blessed? Did you rainbow him in 300 stones? Something like that. Oh, okay, Piccolo and Krillin. <laughs> Three Gogeta's on the way. We got the Whis or the the uh, what are they called again? Zeno. Fake out. 
There's the fake out. And... Gogeta! Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. There we go. JP content on the way. Yo. <laughs> Dude. Third multi, man. Third multi. The last time that happened to me on my JP account, or my uh, global account, rather, my main account, I don't even know. Okay, I don't know the last time it took me more less than a thousand stones to pull one copy of the new unit. So this is good, man. This is this this is good. Yo, JP, this is how to get me back. This is how to get me back. Okay, so that was the first copy. We got Super Saiyan God, so there's gonna be two more, right? Oh, yo, I thought it was gonna be another fake out. Okay, no fake out there. Hopefully another featured unit, maybe. Go bros. No. Oh, okay. We got we got we got Boo. Yo, that kid Boo, I feel like, even though he has an EZA already, I feel like his EZA needs an EZA, right? Because I used him recently, and he wasn't that impressive. I don't know about you guys, but EZA, AGL, kid Boo. Still, like, cannot tank. Damage, okay. Not the greatest either for a nuker. Um, he does heal, though, right? So, like, there's there's that, I guess. Like, he, he does provide a little bit. But then, like, he gets hit so hard, it doesn't even matter. Um, anyways, there's Gogeta. Boom. Done. I love it. Am I, man, should I just keep going? I don't even know. I don't know. We got three more multis. Uh, if I do plan to play the JP side more, maybe I should save my stones. Nah, screw it. We can't, we can't just leave on three multis. We'll do six. I promise six. We're doing six. That's the first copy, though. If you get a dupe here, that, of course, would uh, make my life. Not just my day. Not just my week. It would make my life. We got two here. Because that would just be awesome. Please, RNG Gods, Bandai. No, you know what? I'm not gonna call it Bandai, because Bandai, um, they always mess with me. They always troll me. So I'm gonna just pray to the RNG Jesus, RNG Gods. Come on, give me one more Gogeta, and we're out. Okay, and then and then I promise I'll give you more money on the JP side. Because <laughs> right now you're not making any money off me, right? I mean, aside from the stones I bought here, but you know, they're not making any mo money off me on the JP side regularly. So if you give me another Gogeta now, then I promise, man, I will stick around and I will buy more packs and you will get more money from me on the JP side, especially because the JP stones are actually quite a bit more expensive than the global stones. I think it's like a 10, 15% difference. Okay, so we got Yamcha and Vegeta. It does go Super Saiyan. Now, I do have a track record of not getting fusions with these guys, but it is possible. I've seen it. Okay, it, it took like 20 of them, like 20 appearances with like Vegeta and Yamcha to like actually happen, but we did get the fusion the last time I got it. Not this time though. Not this time. Okay, so second like last multi, guys. Okay, we're gonna go after this. Um, or after the next multi, rather, because I just, I, I, I'm tempted to buy more stones, but I can't do it because I still gotta maintain the global side. I still gotta spend money on other things, right, in life, or Genshin and stuff like that. So, that being said, Last multi here, we are going to do a group summon if you guys want to join in. So feel free to uh, get your games ready and uh, summon with me when the time is here. We got launch. I'll take that. I think that's actually new for this account. I could be wrong, but I think it might be. Let me lock her up real quick. And last multi group summon, guys. Okay, last multi group summon. Jump in with me if you can, if you want to. Uh, not quite a combination. Ooh, fusion though. Fusion. Okay, I'm gonna pull down. You guys pull down too. Okay, let's go together. In three, two, one. Let it rip. Here we go. All right, so we're going Super Vegito. I guess it doesn't really matter too much which Vegito we go, but um, guaranteed Dokkan Fest, right? So it could be, oh man, it could be the old Gogeta. It could be Omega Shenron. It could be a lot of things. It could be um, Go Bros. Actually, yeah, I didn't want it to go blue. No, I forgot that Cobros are on here, so they're the LR that could give us Vegito Blue animation. But we don't want that, because as much as I like Cobros, I have them on this account, and I just want more Gogetas. So, yeah, it could be the new Gogeta, it could be the old Gogeta, it could be Omega Shenron, could be Piccolo. Um, who else? Kefla, possibly. She would be new, so that'd be nice. And, uh, I guess that's it. That's pretty much all I need. A full power Super Saiyan 4, I think, would be new too, but like I said, I just don't... I'm not that... Oh. Okay, Kefla. I'll take Kefla. I think she is new. I don't think I have her on this account. But uh, I was going to say, um, yeah, full power Super Saiyan 4 is just not that impressive to me anymore. So I don't care too much about getting him. I hope we get a new updated version sometime in the near future because he definitely, like that form definitely deserves it, right? 
But there you go guys, that is the last multi, we ended off with a Kefla, pretty awesome pull actually. And uh, quick overview, I think this is the character box. <laughs> and let's go for acquired SSRs. And 11 SSR, yo look at that, I forgot about this guy too. So we got Nova Shenron, we got Gogeta, so two new units acquired, we got Kefla who I believe is new. Uh, there is my LR Cobros, I think I have one that's like at least halfway awakened. Uh, either way, there you go. And uh, if you guys want to see what my JP account looks like, not that impressive, but uh, still pretty good. I do need to awaken some more units. I mean, obviously the Gogeta now, so might do that on stream. Maybe we'll do the uh, maybe we'll do the LR Frieza grind too. And I, I have nothing done in this account though. Like I don't have a single medal for Prime Battle Goku, Prime Battle Frieza, or even a free to play farming team. I think so. That's gonna be tough. I'll think about it. Anyways, that is the video, guys. Let's leave with uh, this man on the screen to show our uh, the, the, the fruits of our labor, I guess. <laughs> and I uh, hope you guys are having some great luck out there, too. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.